the hospitality industry is much broader than most other industries. The majority of business industries are composed of only a handful of different businesses, but this industry applies to nearly any company that is focused on meeting customer satisfaction and meeting leisurely needs rather than basic ones. Although the industry is very broad, there are some defining aspects that are important to consider. The hospitality industry is a broad category of fields within the service industry that includes lodging, restaurants, events planning, theme parks, transportation, cruise line and additional fields within the tourism industry. The hospitality industry is a several billion dollar industry that mostly depends on the availability of leisure time and disposable income. A hospitality unit such as a restaurant, hotel or even an amusement park consists of multiple groups such as facility maintenance, direct operations, management, marketing and human resources. We have targeted the hospitality industry for our business opportunity. This business opportunity is based in the centre of Paisley Town. Peeled bar, restaurant, live event space and barcade. We identified this opportunity after looking into the nightlife experience of Paisley and concluding that there is a lack of late night bars and restaurants that satisfy the needs of both students and the public. The simplest explanation for our idea is a student union open to the public as well as students. With a minimalist but stylish decor and brand identity, the business would look appealing to the public as it isn't overly stylistic or made to look exclusive to one specific demographic. The name of the business would be Vlem, which doesn't really mean anything and therefore is more likely to stand out and stick in people's minds, as it sounds mysterious and intriguing. Vlem itself would be made up of a first floor bar and restaurant, which sells affordable but gourmet food, including vegan options to appeal to that niche demographic. When carrying out research of the local area, the quality of restaurants in Paisley Town is quite lacking when compared to Glasgow and this is an opportunity which Vlem could exploit. This area appeals to the public because everyone eats and many people drink socially. On top of this, we will be providing delivery of food from Vlem, which is another big risk for a startup business, but if we can organise a food delivery app to expedite this process, we will have an edge on any of the local competition. The second floor would be made up of a bigger bar area with a live event space which could host local bands, pub quizzes, karaoke and stand-up comedy nights. During our research, we found that comedy nights have become increasingly popular among bars in Paisley, which facilitate such events. The third floor of Vlem would be a barcade, which is a room with pool tables, dartboards and arcades machines, as well as including a bar space. Barcades have become increasingly popular in recent years, with the closest competitor to this niche being Super Barrio in Glasgow, which is a very popular barcade, but is limited by its size. This would be taking advantage of a market trend in the hospitality sector. Overall, Vlem would appeal to a wide array of markets, as well as taking advantage of some market trends by including the barcade as well as live event space. However, this is far from a sure thing because the hospitality sector tends to have quite a thin profit margin. It, we believe, if implemented properly, that Vlem could dominate the nightlife scene in Paisley. In this assignment, our entrepreneurs have identified a business opportunity in Paisley Town Centre. There is a gap in the market allowing our team to be creative and innovative when taking advantage of this opportunity. However, before establishing our idea, the relevant research and analysis is vital um, if this is to succeed, such as SWOT and pest analysis of a project. In the first instance, I will discuss the impact of our idea on both the internal and external environment. To give an example, we will examine Vlem's internal strengths and weaknesses together with the external opportunities and threats that may arise throughout the business year. Initially, I would like to begin by analysing obvious strengths that allow our idea to stand out and prove successful. Our concept of a three-storey facility provides a wider range of interest as it caters for all tastes manned by highly skilled and experienced staff throughout each department. This proves beneficial as profits will rise as our pitch reaches out to all market segments. Our long-term plan to recruit junior staff on casual part-time work will save the organisation time and effort in recruitment and selection as junior staff will be required to gain qualifications on the job and externally to climb up the business ladder. This will promote staff and loyalty and a decrease in staff turnover as staff will feel valued through the faith of the manager. Um, increased staff satisfaction will result in raised effort levels as they learn new skills and expertise on the job. On the other hand, we are aware that our creation comes with drawbacks that impacts on our internal environment one of which includes a highly expensive startup cost of between £1.5 and £3 million which is required to fund relevant expenses such as the wages of skilled workers as well as the funding of training schemes and college courses. 
Due to Blen being located near the university, it is not rare to find that the students don't have disposable income available to them, therefore may not be able to afford the service that we aim to provide. Another weakness that may uh, prove costly for Blen is due to the worrying rate of unemployment that may affect the regularity of custom from locals, which will contribute greatly in a lack of profit for the company. However, we must consider the external opportunities that impact on our business, such as the increasing likelihood of regular income as the business offers to climb um, several, several choices of entertainment. Increased profits can be gained as the project can benefit from the lack of competition in the immediate area, as currently Paisley has no similar venue of this nature, offering such a full entertainment experience. This is perfectly um, true for students in the town. Re um, research has proven that students would take advantage of this type of diverse facility. Also in the university town, there will always be a considerable no um, number of hardworking students looking to take on part-time work on a flexible basis in a social active environment. Brexit is a pending threat to business opportunities within the UK as we are um, unaware of the full financial implications of leaving the EU, starting a new business will be high risk. In order to scan the environment, we must implement the BESEL analysis. So what exactly is BESEL? BESEL is a acronym for Political, Economic, Social, Technological, Legal and Environmental. According to Kettle, BESEL analysis provides a framework for investigating and analyzing the external environment for an organization. The framework identifies six key areas that should be considered when attempting to identify the sources of change. Let's start with political analysis. Brexit has been a hot topic for the past few months because of its large impact of, on the economy of the UK. In case of a no-deal Brexit and changes in trading legislations with EU, supply problems might occur as UK imports around 30% of food from EU. Consequently, farmers might exploit the lack of cheaper alternatives from EU and increase the prices of goods they produce, in example meat, vegetables or wheat. When establishing a business focused on food, we must take into consideration a tax policy. According to UK government, there is 20% VAT on everything eaten in the restaurant's premises, 20% VAT on all food and food deliveries and no VAT on food, so our business will promote food to maximum profits. Economic analysis. We must decide whether to buy or rent premises and delivery cars based on the interest rates. If the interest rates are too high, better option is to rent and after a few year, years, reinvest the profits and buy. Also, we must take consumer spending into consideration. According to national records of Scotland, around 70 people in Glasgow area are aged 16 to 64 and the purchase power has increased in the past few years. Financially stable people who are willing to spend a bit more on a quality food are a priority. Social analysis. Demographic changes should be carefully observed. Older people might not be familiar with the delivery systems, so that is why we offer both eating in a restaurant and delivery. On the other hand, the general lifestyle has become more fast-paced and people don't have time for long several course dinners and that is why we offer delivery. By targeting influencers on social media, our business could be effectively promoted within younger generations. Technological Analysis In the era of smartphones, we will develop an app which would make it easier to order food for pickup or to order ahead of arriving at a restaurant. Customers would also have an option how to pay, secure online payment or cash. Modern technology could also have impact on food processing. With modern high-tech equipment, food, food would be healthier. Legal analysis. UK, still as a part of EU, has free movement. It is easy to employ skilled workers from EU and EEA. With the upcoming Brexit, that might change, so we would have to adapt as quickly as possible and try to keep skilled employees from outside of UK in our business. There is also a minimum wage we would have to pay to our workers. According to CIPD, employers have health and safety duties under the Health and Safety at Work Act from 1974. Our business would emphasize the importance of health and safety and also would conduct regular health and safety trainings. Environmental Analysis Pollution has become one of the world's biggest problems and in order to reduce the pollution, we would focus on waste recycling and reducing carbon emissions. Electric cars for delivery are environmental friendly, but the problem is they are short range. However, according to Glasgow City Council, there are over 80 charging stations throughout the Glasgow area. Furthermore, when it comes to ethics, fair trade program is something we would emphasize. I want to 
your recommendation to any willing investors or entrepreneurs looking for a high risk business idea wishing to invest in the hospitality specifically in paisley will be that this opportunity is appealing because it doesn't have any major competition aside from the student union at the paisley campus uws the closest competition to the business idea flame will be in glasgow but again is spread across multiple locations rather than centralized on specific area we believe that this opportunity presents itself with a lot of friend as it tailors to a large group of customers and also has a good ethical and social mindset in its very foundation. Because of its proximity to UWS, there will be a large number of potential clients who prefer substitute to the student union as during our research in the field, we found that the student union is lacking in appeal. To conclude, because of the uniqueness of this business, its stylistic approach and the large market it appeals to, we believe it to be very viable entrepreneurial opportunity with potential to expand to other markets, potentially being franchised, with co which competes with student unions across the UK.